Hey everybody, how you doing out there? It's yours truly, Dave Nation, coming to you live in full effect. I just want to talk about a story about this lady who's 19 years old, and uh, this is a mystery. This is a mystery case, folks. This is a mystery case. They're going to open up the mystery case. This lady who uh, was in a hotel, apparently had a big, huge party and sometime around 2017. And, um, yeah, big, huge party, and all of a sudden, uh, she... Um, Apparently, uh, in this party, uh, a group of people in this hotel uh, place, and uh, the story I'm talking about, I think her name is Jenkins. I don't know what's her name, Jenkins, I guess, something. Anyway, this girl who uh, partied uh, with a lot of uh, her uh, friends there, and uh, all of a sudden, all of a sudden, uh, they were at a hotel, and this girl happened to want to go to the washroom, couldn't find a washroom, and ended up on the... Um, the downstairs were um, where the kitchens were and stuff like that. So she didn't know her way and everything. So she was looking through the whole hotel and all of a sudden, all of a sudden, this is uh, according to the story, all of a sudden she locked her, uh, somebody locked her up in a freezer. I don't know why people lock themselves in a freezer, but this lady... Now, apparently, apparently, they ruled her out, but uh, someone murdered her. Someone definitely murdered her. Um, what the allocations are and the uh, videos are that, uh, yeah, it wasn't a, a uh, it wasn't just, uh, somebody mur murdered her in a, in a hotel. And there's one murder, and I forget her name, but I'll mention in the title about her. Um, it's getting a little airplay on YouTube videos and a lot of tons of videos about her. Uh, there's a lot of updates, and since 2017, her mom, her sister, are always talking about it to this day. Uh, in 2017, uh, uh, her and her best friends, close friends, these are black people, these are black people, not to be racist or anything, but uh, I'm, I'm white. I'm a white person. I'm a white person, my per se. But when I see cases like that, um, and there's a lot of videos up there claiming that this woman um, has been murdered, apparently she has, and uh, this was at a hotel. I forget the ho hotel name. But anyway... They have surveillance footage of of a uh, tracking her all around the uh, all around this hotel uh, with surveillance cameras. Uh, and hotels sometimes they would have surveillance cameras every corner, every inside of the hotel, all the walkways in the hotel, all the way down to the lobby to the you name it, where the food area is. So yeah, they have surveillance cameras. They have a CTC TV kind of thing. Uh, they have these. TV, uh, they're not like TV cameras, they're like surveillance cameras, they're like security cameras, in a way. And they film movement, they film people's movement, all the way inside and outside of a business place. Um, this is in a hotel, this is in walkways. Sometimes they, hotels would have big, long walkways, and uh, this lady was trying to find the washroom, and... She looked all around. I don't know. People were uh, claiming that her eyes were closed and stuff like that. She was crying about it a couple of times. She was looking around just for a washroom and everything. Hopefully someone will... Uh, I don't know. The whole story was kind of weird in a way. But anyway, I did mention her name on the last video. And I just want to point that out. That uh, That's why the reason why I put her name up there. Because that's her name going on the title of her, of the, of her videos and stuff. This is a young lady at 19 years old, 19 years old. Uh, this is way past the, um, um, Caitlin Nicole Davis, uh, video. She was 12. This girl is 19 years old, uh, past the adult age. Um, but yeah, she had this party of her close knit friends, I guess. I don't know. Claim, uh, from the security footage. Um, all around, all around the hotel, all around the hotel, these are black people. These are black people with the uh, video shown. Um, these are black people. Um, I don't know what the nationality is, but they're black people as far as my eyes is concerned. Um, and yeah, so this is, for some strange reason, they made it out to be a big story. They really made it out to be a big story, folks. They really did. This was a very big story for a lot of people, and uh, it happened in 2017. So this is like a year after Caitlin Nicole Davis. This is like a few months after she... Um, this was at a hotel. It wasn't like at her 
at her house or anything. This is uh, people having fun at a party in a hotel. I don't know why they would do that, but they did at a hotel and all places. They didn't do it. At, uh, they didn't have a party at a, someone's house or anything where they crashed the house in and stuff like that. You know, they do damage to the property and stuff like that. No, they just did it at a hotel. Had a party. A bunch of friends start going there in 2017 in a hotel. They didn't crash the room or anything. They just. Uh, this had a party and stuff like that. Just a few of their friends, close knit friends, and yeah, just went to a hotel and apparently it was in the news. And uh, this happened way back in 2017. Um, for some strange reason, I told the year that it happened. I don't know the month, but I know the year that it happened. Sometime around 2017. Pretty sure it was the summertime. Sometime around there. But yeah, I I uh, far as the, far as the YouTube video is concerned, they didn't mention her name. By name, they mentioned her name by name on the ti on the titles of the videos. Um, apparently, they uh, she had her uh, she has a sister, um, and apparently her sister is speaking out on it. Uh, but her mother, I think her mother just got on radio station. There is a footage of her mom being on uh, her mother being on a radio station and trying to tell the whole story about what led up to her. Uh, she, uh, she apparently got murdered by somebody, uh, somebody in the hotel. Not some, uh, odd person, but just someone in the hotel. Um, in these hotels, they have security cameras. They melt them on top of the area. On top, way, way, way up top of the area. You'll see them when you go in these hotels. Um, but they call, uh, they use them for security reasons. Inside and out, around the uh, hotel. And uh, these are security cameras. They, they're like surveillance footage. They're like surveillance footage. They uh, do people's movement and stuff like that. So they capture people's movement from, from a top of the area, from where they where they mount them on top of the uh, ceiling, uh, from where they where you can see them. And there's surveillance cameras all in, uh, inside the area of the of the hotel. I forget the name of the hotel, but yeah, it was at a hotel. I, I finally forgot what the hotel is. I won't mention here on the title, but yeah. But yeah, this girl, I'll mention her name, and I'll mention the hotel that she'd been with. Um, so this is a case story. This is definitely a case story. It's open. The case story is definitely open from all the way back to 2017. They haven't found the people who've done it, as uh, far as I can tell. Um, but the, uh, one video was saying, claiming that the, uh, the security people that, were, uh, that owned that hotel... Uh, were suspect uh, to her uh, something. I know. Anyway, it, it it goes on. It goes on like a story kind of thing. But uh, yeah, you can clearly see her. You can see this young lady who's tw 19 years old, trying to just of all things, trying to find a washroom, and all of a sudden ends up in the kitchen in a freezer. And uh, the story is, and these people are black, black. Uh, the I'm not trying to put the racist card here, folks. To black. Uh, I think African American, I think it was an African American. But anyway, uh, I don't want to be racist here, folks, but clearly you see in the footage, they're African American. They're from the black people, I guess. The I don't know. What do you call these people? Um, and yeah, she, uh, her last days was in a freezer. And uh, apparently there's a cover-up. Some videos were claiming that it was a cover-up. Uh, it wasn't um uh, Clear cut. It was a cover up. Apparently, some videos did say in their titles a cover up uh, to this story. I didn't mention it on the last video, but there was a cover up to this vi uh, to this case story, um, and uh, it was a cover up. It was definitely a cover up. Uh, I don't know for what reason. I don't know, but videos uh, videos were saying that the uh, the uh, the security guards that were in, I guess, in the hotel. Uh, are suspect. I don't know. There's many leads. They say many leads to the story. Uh, but yeah, this girl has lost her life uh, in a freezer, and there's no ice there. There's no ice. They said a couple of times there was no ice there. There was no ice to be seen in this freezer, and apparently that uh, apparently the um, kitchen was never used. I mean, never used in the hotel for some strange reason. I don't know why. But anyway, the whole thing is strange. But. Uh, it's a, I think it was a, a, a American, a black and American, uh, I don't, I don't know what kind of race these people, but I'm a white, my, I'm a white person myself, but, uh, 
it was tons of videos on her name. You just type in her name. And there's tons of videos on YouTube about her. Uh, there were apparently one video was saying there was a cover up about this whole thing, and the case is still open. One video was saying that the case is still open. Uh, they're and they're trying to find the people who've done it, kind of thing. Um, they one video was claiming that the, um, the security people in that hotel were to blame. Um, uh, but yeah, uh, but yeah, this lovely lady who's age 19 has a, had a sister. I didn't realize this. This is new information to me uh, that she had a sister. So her sister is apparently going uh, uh, has her story side of the story. Uh, I don't know. She's going on there and telling her side of the story, kind of thing. But her mom said a lot on a radio station about the whole scenario about this. But I told the girl's name on a title. Um, this is not the Nicole uh, uh, Davis uh, um, videos. This is from this other girl. It's this girl already 19 years old, but in 2017. So 19 of her uh, luscious life, uh, she died in a hotel. One death in a hotel. Can you believe this? One death in a hotel. Never unheard of. Unheard of, folks. Unheard of. Anyway. Uh, people, a uh, few videos were saying it was a cover-up. People say it was like security people were suspect. Um, so it's it's like a conspiracy theory. Round and round. But it's a, definitely a cover-up. No question about it. There was a few videos on there saying there was a cover-up. Um, and they have time, uh, they have the time stamped. They have the time stamped. And they had the year that it actually happened when she roamed the uh, hallways of that hotel. Um, the surveillance footage there in 2017, that's what the surveillance footage was showing. Um, and 2017, this was uh, these surveillance cameras. They have footage. This, they would have some hard drives footage on it. And uh, yeah, so I didn't mention her. I don't know if it's cover up or not, but they're trying to look for these people who done who uh, did her, you know, kind of harm, like in a way. Um, so she left the dead, and uh, I don't know if they found the person or not. I don't know. I really don't know that well. I'm here to the videos for the videos I'm seeing on YouTube. It looks like it was a cover up. It looks like uh, all she wanted to do was just to go to the bathroom, and all of a sudden it. It kind of, uh, she, she was uh, walking. I don't know, other, uh, this one guy was running, the security guy was running in, in the hotel uh, lobby. Uh, not in the lobby, but in the uh, hallways of the hotel uh, for something strange reason. But anyway, I guess in security cameras, every, everybody should, uh, looks like a suspect to, uh, to everybody. It doesn't matter who they are, actually. Uh, everybody's a suspect. You just never know in these situations. But yeah, uh, with security footage, lucky we have cameras nowadays with security cameras. Security cameras are basically 24 hours a day, some days a week, night and day security cameras. And hotels, these are hotel buildings where you go and uh, spend a few days at a hotel. But they do have surveillance cameras outside and inside of the building uh, of the hotel and security cameras. And they would have footage of this. Uh, and, uh, yeah, so folks, I did mention her name on the last video. I'll mention it again. This is just pure speculation. I'm going to go further. And, um, uh, yeah, so folks, um, go type in her name. I typed her name in the last video. Um, that's her name, by the way. That's her name as far as, far as the titling of the thumbnails were concerned. Um, I made sure I, uh, I made sure that I spelled her name properly according to the titling. Uh, but yeah, that's her name. That's her name as far as the... Um, I looked it up. I did look up her name on Wikipedia and got a little bit more information. She, she was 19 years old at the time according to what I've heard the story. And yeah, so folks, that's it. That's it. So, Seville's footage did show her walking, uh, you know, just walking along the... Uh, the hallways of uh, the hotel. Just looking for a wash. Can you believe a person like her, 19 years old, just looking for a wash and all of a sudden, Len, she kind of walked around and... <laughs> and uh, a few videos were saying it was a cover-up to, to this whole this thing. And I don't know. One video uh, said that she was crying. 
the other video, she was uh, just, you know, she was alone. She was alone with all these videos uh, as surveillance videos. And uh, she's just walking along the hall hallways and stuff. And uh, you can see her clearly in the, in the security footage. Um, and, uh, yeah, so they're looking around. <laughs> And there's a lot of tons of footage. I mean, tons of footage. Tons of footage, folks. Uh, from the raw footage, from the uh, uh, one guy really, really uh, kind of narrated it, um, how to happen. But just, uh, yeah, he narrated it really good. So anyway, I did mention her name in the last video. I don't know. I'm going to have to hear some of her video, uh, the videos and see what her name was so I can get a, a grasp at what her name was. But yeah, she did have a sister... And I think the sister's speaking out on it, um, about the, about the case of it. This happened way back in 27, uh, 2017, uh, and, uh, according to the footage, surveillance footage, it has a timestamp and year, and that's what surveillance cameras do, what they have timestamps. Um, uh, timestamps, uh, when they see these people walk around inside the hotel or outside the hotel, um, so, clearly, clearly it's time-stamped, it's a, it's a, we call it time clock, time-stamped thing, uh, on top of the screen of the uh, surveillance footage, um, and, and the year, and the date, so, all of that is all in the surveillance footage. Uh, the raw footage, they showed the raw footage, and unedited, they did have some footage of unedited, uh, and that's pretty much it, folks, and, uh, yeah. So, folks, we're gonna, we're gonna, um, and that's what it is. I just, uh, so this happened way back in 2017, and she was 20, uh, 19. There's a lot of videos of her, of her name. Just like, uh, just like Caitlin Nicole Davis. Same, same thing, but this time it didn't, uh, she didn't commit suicide or anything. She, somebody murdered her, this other girl. So, anyway. So, folks, like I said, just go check it out. I'll t type in her name on this one again. I really, really emphasize this. Um, so anyway, there.